So this is the RAL E version from Mahindra, which is based on the BE5 EV concept. Uh, it's of course a concept as of now, uh, based for the off-roading world, and that's why you see these tires, you see the race variants, you see. Uh, extra add-ons on the roof which have a spare wheel and of course the extra battery packs completely based on the BE5 concept which is basically behind this car right, car right now. Uh, we are in Hyderabad, uh, lots and lots of crowd over here but I'll try to get you some visuals. Of course the interiors are closed because it's in concept at this stage, not a reality. Uh, reality will be happening in the next couple of years time but uh, Mahindra is very very sure they want to make off-roaders based on electric SUVs. They have BE or born electric SUVs coming up in the next few years in the Indian market and uh, this one is more different. Uh, I'm sorry a lot of influencers over here so influencers and uh, their photographs will keep on happening but it's completely based on this particular vehicle. This is the BE5. Uh, Mahindra has not one not two but five different uh, born electric BE SUVs. The ESV is coming to India in the next few years time. Uh, this is one of them, the BE5. And uh, on this is based the off-roading version. Uh, Pure Electric comes home the first time they are showcasing uh, electric SUV in the market. A look at the interiors. So yeah, everything is closed right now because they are on the concept stage uh, from your wheels to the outside mirrors to even the interiors which are close to us right now. So everything on the concept stage but uh, BE5 and of course the off-roading version of the BE5 they call it RALE which is R-A-L-L-E. -E. e of course stands for EV or electric vehicle. So RALE right over here on Max's all terrain tires uh, the car was not driven it was lifted on this uh, ramp from beneath so not working as of now concept stage but because the platform is completely designed for electric vehicles you can expect class leading room space you can expect a lot of technology you can expect uh, expect range you can expect all wheel drive 4x4 uh, twin motors with the power going to all the four wheels uh, good uh, color combination as well uh, you can see the front now plate with BE RAL dash E, which is basically Rally. One more look at the road going EV version uh, the way it weighs the tires 21 inch uh, alloy wheels or the front end, which is basically inspired from the XV700. Uh, you have also clever elements like that arrow bridge you can see. I'll try to zoom in. Yeah, it says arrow bridge. So, a lot of clever elements coming into vehicles from Mahindra's family. But back to the off road version. I'm sorry, a lot of uh, influencers coming in over here and blocking the entire view of the car. We will try to show you the car in detail. Uh, good lift for the uh, ground clearance, good add on elements for off roading. And of course, your uh, lights, uh, auxiliary lights on the roof, and your extra tires and your battery packs. Uh, back to the normal electric version. These are still on the concept stage, of course. A lot of things will be changed. For example, uh, you have PE over here, and you have something called as the swipe to connect. So basically, you need to swipe your cards to connect and open the doors. Uh, so tech is coming from Mahindra's side. Uh, the charging port for this one is over here. Press to open. It says the charging port over here, and uh, we can expect LED DRLs all over the place from the rear to the front. Uh, one more cool feature about this particular concept vehicle has to be the lights coming in. Uh, these could be the higher place tail lights uh, just to warn others that you're braking in traffic. But of course, concept stage as of now. Of course, no exhaust, but sort of dummy uh, diffusers coming in at the rear. And I just can't have enough of this color combination of uh, the Rally E version. This combination of black and uh, parrot green, I would say, is definitely rocking in every single sense over here at this place in Hyderabad. Uh, a closer look at the uh, rear, uh, the spare wheel, the carrier. Of course, it's sporty, it's got a uh, spoiler as well at the back. But yeah, look at the ground clearance coming in.
You also, of course, have the SUV E9 plays over here. I'll try to get a different video of this only SUV. The rear somewhat looks like the EV6 from Kia with a lighter design, but nevertheless, this is the bigger of the other vehicles. Uh, huge in size, and of course, uh, carries the SUV moniker uh, to carry forward the legacy of uh, SUV brand in the market. We also have uh, the special edition, which was basically auctioned off at over one crore. Is the rims in Dadu edition? It's been sold off. Uh, the auction has been done. Uh, this is how the interiors look like. Uh, there are elements, for example, this one on the seats. Uh, the lights are off, so sorry for this. But yeah, one, two, three, four vehicles uh, enjoying all the limelight uh, in Hyderabad from Mahindra's BE9.